Don't you hate when you're driving down the road and you see a vehicle that looks like it ought to be a cop car, but it's not a cop car. It's just a couple of people that probably own a cleaning business. And it makes me think like I should probably get into the cleaning business because they have some pretty nice vehicles. That's not why we're here. That's just the random thought on the top of my dome. We are here to use our epic narrator voice. Mostly because I know that Madam Skillet of the Home Skillet Channel just absolutely loves it. And I like the fact that I can talk this deeply. In a world off-grid, two people have decided to make a living, to make a go of it on the side of a mountain with no electricity and an embryo. Can they do it? We don't know, but we're pretty sure they're probably going to. <laughs> oh, I have had a day, and uh, I'm gonna go back into the narrator voice. And while they were living on the side of this mountain, a volcano of doom erupted, and there was a tsunami and one-third of the people on Earth perished, and one-third of the moon and sun went dark, and one-third of the cows danced the Macarena, and other weird things happened, as foretold by John. Pretty sure a part of that translation got messed up, but who am I to tell? Who am I to tell? After the day I've had, I just need to have a little bit of fun, so... We'll call this a video response, unprovoked video response, to Home Skillet and Schnooks, and I would like to hear your epic narrator voice. And probably pretty soon before this Kia behind me rear ends me, and I hop out of this vehicle and break them in two with my bare hands. B-E-A-R hands. Squid and Bear, coming up next. Bye.